post a picture of an outfit that I built this morning and uh, wore throughout most of the day. It seems like I end up changing 10 times out of the day, right? Um, but I've been thinking and, and as I'm expanding and growing with you guys and offering more services and um, bringing you guys different life tools, uh, life hacks, meditations, um, amazing vintage clothing and modern thrifts. I'm also bringing you guys uh, my art and uh, lifestyle choices as well. So um, I've really uh, come through a lot to get into this beautiful place that I'm at. And um, it didn't just happen for any reason. So um, as I take you guys on my journey, I, I, I really want to um, express the beauty that I have in my life around me and share it with you guys so that you know it's possible so that um, even when it seems like the odds are at their hardest um, you will get through it you will be okay uh, the universe never throws more at you than you can handle and that's one of the things that I really struggled with a lot of my life so um, yeah, I, I'm really excited to, to, to bring this to you guys and to broaden my horizons and start sharing some different things with you. Um, I'm going to be bringing a lot of art, a lot of jewelry, um, all handmade stuff by me. Uh, my family was a, a group of artisans, uh, like I've stated in some of my previous videos. So uh, I have an eclectic um, skill of kind of transforming just normal things into beauty per se this gallery wall um i put this together uh from my art my mother's art um this piece is the only foreign piece on uh this wall otherwise it is me my mom and my uncles and i was able to make a beautiful gallery wall um i can go over with you guys the uh the way that I learned and um, envisioned and figured out how to put this together. Um, I, I took some beautiful pressed flowers here um, that mom had made years and years ago on cards for, for greeting cards for her business to send out. And uh, I cut them up, framed them, and they're some of the most gorgeous pieces of art that I have. Really simple, like awesome things like that. Um, and pressing flowers isn't hard either, and I can teach you guys that as well. Okay guys, third eye vintage here. So, this is the outfit that I just posted, and um, it was a really simple build. Uh, I picked up these uh, vintage Adidas Vietnam tennis shoes. They say Bangkok on them, they're beautiful. Uh, I picked up these, these modern thrift north face shorts that uh were absolutely steel the lining's brand new you know what i mean um got the cinch waist and uh those ones i'm probably gonna keep honestly i got the tiger socks from target just to kind of throw off the whole outfit uh that black and white is a really good theme but then to put uh like a gray monotone with just little pops of color is is a gorgeous thing uh, I'm really excited about this one, guys. I got both of these thrift. Um, it's not gold. This is vintage. This is a vintage piece of jewelry right here. Just absolutely gorgeous. The chain is fake gold. Really easy build, really easy to put together. That's uh, also for sale. Um, we've got the nice, big, oversized double XL Obey. Uh, I'm really digging the oversized look with, uh, shorts right now because yeah, it just kind of sets the whole outfit off. And then the, the look of short shorts this summer, which is kind of what's going on for guys is, um, is the best thing anyway. So yeah, uh, then we got this, um, vintage Nissan, pretty much dead stock nine and a half out of 10 condition for being white. Nissan made in the Philippines, Highline traffic marking, awesome hand sewn, gorgeous piece. 